Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jackie and today I am here to do my December library haul. So I did not do a library haul in November and that's mostly because I didn't really have the time to go to my library. As most of you guys know, I participated in NaNoWriMo all last month so the only books I really checked out for my library were audiobooks and yeah, no physical books last month. So this month I definitely went full on. I got seven books this month, which I'm all very excited to read. So I'm going to jump right in and get started. So the first book I have to talk about today is Simon vs. Homo Sapiens Agenda by Becky Albertalli. This book has been making its way around book two for about a year and a half now and everybody really seems to like it. And this is a YA contemporary fiction novel that follows our main character Simon who is gay but he has not come out yet. And he has been DMing this boy named Blue online but he has no idea who this boy's real identity is and then one day he is blackmailed and he is threatened to reveal uh, who this boy is if he doesn't do something. I'm really not sure what that thing is but this is becoming a movie in March I want to say so I really do want to read it and like I said I've heard nothing but good things about it. I know that there was another book by this author which was kind of a sequel Twit called The Upside of Unrequited that came out in April, I want to say, and there's also another book that comes out in April of next year that I want to read called Leah on the Offbeat. So, very excited to read this. The next book I checked out from my library is Forest of a Thousand Lanterns by Julie C. Dow. Now, this is an East Asian Evil Queen retelling that has also been making its way around booktube lately. Now, I actually just bought this book for myself from Barnes & Noble, which you guys would have seen in my book haul that I uploaded last week, so I'll have that linked down below, but I picked this up from the library before I ended up buying it. And also, if you guys saw my NaNoWriMo vlogs, I wrote an Evil Queen retelling for that myself, so this might be some more inspiration to get me back on track with that project, so I'm really excited to read this. And the next book I picked up is called Otherworld, and this is by Jason Siegel and Kristen Miller. I saw this being talked about over at Jesse or Jesse the Reader's channel. This was one of his book club, uh, I think it's called Book Explosion. That was, this was one of their picks. And this is a science fiction novel that seems to be about some sort of video game. That's what I'm getting from the synopsis, which, which there isn't really one. But it sounds pretty cool. It has to do with virtual reality, it seems like. So, hmm. Very interesting and very excited to pick this one up. And the last four books I picked up from my library are interesting. So they're actually all self-help books. And if you guys have been watching either my reading vlogs I've been doing or any of my NaNoWriMo vlogs, you would have known I've been working on a secret project. And I picked up some books to help me with that as well as, you know, help me get my social media game up. So they're all, like I said, self-help books. So the first one I called, I got from my library is Blog Design for Dummies and this is by Melissa Culbertson. This is about helping to get your blog up and going and make it more attractive to your followers. As most of you guys know I do have a blog as well. It's called Evil Queen Books. I actually started that before I started the channel and that's always linked down below. So I'm always looking to help you know make my blog a lot better and attract more attention to it so this will definitely be helpful. The next book I picked up is called YouTube Channels for Dummies and this is by Rod Chiampa and Teresa Moore as well as John Carucci. I apologize if I said any of those names wrong. This is teaching you guys how to either start a YouTube channel or just look to build your audience which again that's always something I am looking into so that I picked up. Next is Social Media for Social Media Design for Dummies, and this is by Janine Warner. This is, again, exactly what it says in the title, How to Up Your Social Media Interest. And the last book I picked up in my library this month is YouTube for Dummies, and this is by Doug Salin. And, again, YouTube for Dummies. Pretty self-explanatory. And I am, I think all those four books I just talked about will be really helpful in the upcoming year. I have a secret project that I've been talking about, like I mentioned earlier, that I have been talking about for a while and I will ex 
especially reveal it in my 2018 goals video that I'm going to be putting up sometime this week. So be on the lookout for that. And these four books are going to come in handy with that and this channel going forward. So really excited to dive more into definite of these and see what I can do as far as getting my presence felt on the internet. So that is all I'm going to have for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already. I'll be sure to have all my social media links linked down below. Those include Twitter, Instagram, Goodreads, and my blog. Again, those are always linked down below. I will also have links to all of these books that I mentioned down below in the description bar if you guys are interested in checking any of those out. And with all that being said, I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day, and I will see you soon for another video. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye!